Hey, welcome to this quick video where we're going to talk about the Azure Connect DK and the new SDK release 1.2 that also introduces C Sharp wrappers, which means you can now build Windows desktop applications using .NET standards with WPF and WinForms. We're also going to talk about a modified sample WPF application, which you can see actually right now. So what you can see is the output from my modified WPF sample coming straight from the Connect. But first of all, what you want to do, you actually want to go to GitHub and download the Azure Connect Sensor SDK or rather clone it with Git. And then you run CMake like instructions tell you, and then you can find uh, the C Sharp samples and the SDK in the SRC slash C Sharp folder. Uh, once you open that with Visual Studio, you can find the uh, C-Sharp wrappers here, a couple of test projects, some extension methods for converting the uh, you know, proprietary image format into something WPF or WinForms understands, and then the WinForms sample as well as the WPF sample. But let's look into my modified sample again, which is this one running right here. What you can do here with this one, I modified it so that it actually doesn't show red or green on a certain distance or the depth uh, on the color frame. But in fact, I wanted to see the grayscale of the depth. So I convert that using a little bit of math here, pretty simple. And then I'm using a little bit of bit shifting like this to actually assign the gray value for the whole uh, BG, uh, RGBA, right? Instead of using these four assignments here, which is, as you know, each of these uh, property assignments actually a method call. So instead of having four of those, I just have one and that saves actually quite a bit of performance because we're running that millions of times in a loop, right? But the also a good performance trick, of course, is you can reduce the color resolution to just use 720p because in fact, the WPF sample window size is much smaller. So, you know, using more pixels just wasted. In fact, I also submitted a pull request already with that little reduction and there are more PRs out there. You really got to love open source, right? All right, I hope you enjoyed this and um, wish you good luck with your experiments using the Azure Connect. Would love to hear what you guys are building and happy coding.